New at 11 tonight, an East Alabama man believes he has developed and is patenting a way to ease the minds of many when it comes to head injuries related to both contact sports and the military. But is this concept the real deal? News Leader 9's Annie Hubble asked professors at Auburn University and has more on this high tech idea. An Opelika man believes he has found a solution to a problem facing athletes everywhere. He has developed a helmet that would completely eliminate the possibility of a concussion or spinal injury. The biggest issue with conventional helmets is direct contact and this alleviates that. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, each year U.S. emergency departments treat an estimated 173,000 sport-related traumatic brain injuries, including concussions in young people. When news surfaced that thousands of former NFL players were suing the league for hiding information that linked football-related head trauma to permanent injuries last year, Rumfeld developed a solution for future generations. The research is finding is that the head injuries are actually on the increase because the equipment is giving a false sense of security. Rumfeld has taken his design to Auburn University and the School of Industrial Design has agreed to do a feasibility study on the helmet if $35,000 is raised to cover research costs. These students get an opportunity to work with an actual client, to work with a manufacturer, to work with an individual. On their idea. Specific details about the helmet cannot yet be released, but with the help of the website Kickstarter.com, Rumfeld hopes he will raise enough money and donations to get this project off the ground into the hands of AU experts and eventually to market. The idea is trying to create concepts, you know, viable solutions uh, for that product. Any contact sports that involves the head, uh, public safety, firefighters, possibly uh, riot control, military, a lot of applications. Now, AU hopes the money will be raised to begin the next step in developing this helmet by the 1st of 2015. If you would like to donate to Rumfeld's idea, by, you can do so by finding his page on kickstarter.com under con concussion proof helmet. We will have a link to that website on our website, WTVM.com. Reporting live in the East Alabama newsroom, Annie Hubble, WTVM News Leader 9.